I came to the very first WOMAD in 1982 at Shepton Mallet and it was just a whole nother experience. The music was so different. The first experience of the drummers of Burundi was something else. Nobody had ever seen anything like it. They bring in people from all over the world who play music that we've never seen and who have cultures that we should experience. Um, and WOMAD does that every time. Uh, Blind Boys are a gospel group that started back in 1939 at the Alabama School for the Negro Blind. Are you feeling good? Yeah! We're all about gospel. We're all about Jesus. We're all about telling the good news. I don't know about you. I'm here with my three girls and my friend who's in the tent just along Kathy, Kathy Kelly. And it's it's her little thing. She does puppet workshops back in the real world. And so she brings it here and we come along as helpers. I do it because music is in my bloodstream really and I don't have a choice about it and I have to, it's like an energy that comes out in the form of songs or, and it's my destiny. The food that I serve is all gourmet vegetarian, mainly vegan food, food that I've devised myself over the years that has been approved by many people, some so much that they said they called their sons Leon. You want to introduce me to your dad? Okay. This is my dad. Yeah, well, it's becoming part of their life. They're growing up with it as a natural awareness rather than uh, something that's outside. So for this generation coming in by being exposed to it, it's just part and they're just conscious of it all the time. In Korean culture, we want to make all the all the feelings like sadness, anger, or enjoyment, things like that. It goes out from our energy. One thing's for sure, everyone knows is the vibe is great. The way um, musicians who don't speak the same language get along and uh, musically can communicate together. I, th I know a lot of groups will be sitting in with Peter tonight who don't, any of them speak the same language as each, each other. Some we rehearsed with, some we didn't, and it'll be great fun. This lot, for a start, it's probably quicker than a, a straight run through, but I think it's an amazing bill they've put together this year. Uh, probably the strongest bill we've ever had. They're not the best paid group of, uh, in the world and they work with a lot of uh, heart and soul and have made something quite extraordinary. This is the only festival that's ever sort of transcended national borders and travelled around the world, introducing the world to the world. In a sense, WOMAD has always been about uh, you know, giving amplification to voices that are out there and that could apply to human rights as well as to music. So now I'm just uh, preparing to get the flute ready and play a song with Peter and hopefully we can make people cry. This is the Wild Woodland Gamelan. It's uh, an installation that we built in the woods in Wales where we live and work. The idea really is to create a nice environment for kids and other people who don't really play music to come play music. One of the aspects of WOMAD is that it's very much a family festival and we're really happy that um, parents who perhaps don't normally get the opportunity to be creative with their children are able to come here and uh, get ideas from using recycled materials which is what we're all about. When you, when you, you know, lean with your ear and listen to the, to the sound of Tanpura, it goes, it, it's synchronized with your body beats. 
My name is Mimita and I dance, I also sing. Hopefully one day I'll be able to sing with Kant, um, Samba Mapangala. <laughs> My name's Tati Dennehy, I'm a sculptor. I've been coming to OMAD for about 12 years now. My work, as you can see, is sort of more or less a celebration of the female form. Marco Matoli, from São Paulo, Brasil. We, uh, Clube do Balanço makes a different kind of samba. We call in, in, in São Paulo, samba rock. Samba rock uh, uh, is not exactly a, a musical style in São Paulo. It's more than a dance style. In Brazil, we have a word called uh, mestiço. Mestiço is, is when a lot of races, a lot of influence, a lot of uh, uh, cultures mix it and mix it and when you mix you 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 have a, a better thing you have a, a better world when you mix not separate mix i got it from leon's it's yeah. vegetarian cuisine but he's doing it for years and he used to it on edible plates which were like that sugar paper plate that you could eat at the end <laughs> So the Doll Foundation is the, the first doll drumming band in the world that put uh, doll drummers as an ensemble and, and worked out beats together and um, play things in unison and sometimes as solos. The spirit of what WOMAD always was and began by being in 1982 is in a sense kind of quite the same in its feeling. It's always been the same. It, it felt very strong when we started. The, the community of, I think, um, goodwill, of, uh, of, of just excitement, of uh, gentleness, which I think are all qualities that are always there inside a WOMAD festival. Uh -huh. Are you ready? God bless you all. Thank you so much. And once again, see you next year. Good night.